hello everyone now we are discussing oops concepts up to now we discussed about encapsulation and abstraction now we are going to see what is inheritance inheritance is nothing but mechanism of getting properties and behavior of superclass into subclass to say this inheritance with real time example parents to child relationship whatever properties or else genes that comes to child it will inherit from their parents that is called inheritance and if we see programmatically here class ece is a child class and it is it extends department this is a parent class this is called inheritance here ec child class is a department class child so it has easy relationship now we will call this ec is a department like that we will call so it is a easy relationship and in java we have has a relationship also has a has a relationship will come in aggregation suppose if we created one object for particular class other than the class what we are using now if we want to access members of that class we will do that by using an object this by, by using this object we will get the properties like object dot get name this is a has a relationship this is called aggregation inheritance is used for code reusability by extending this parent class to child class whatever properties that are available in parent class that will come into child class we will see this with an example now we are going to create one java class this is a parent class here we have some method like this so this is a parent and now we are going to declare child class here uh remember in one source file there will be only one public class and that class name should be the sh should be sh same as with what file name we are saving and now we are going to create object for child class extends and 
object new object dot see here we created an object for child class but we are able to access that methods that are available in parent class also this is called inheritance simply to say this this inheritance child is a inheritance parent so it is a easy relationship inheritance is easy relationship and i told you to that has a relationship also now we are going to create object for inheritance parent this is a has a relationship this is aggregation now we are seeing inheritance we have four types of inheritance that is depends on the classes that we are extended from different classes suppose sing if we see single inheritance here one class extends another class and if we see multiple inheritance here two classes are extended by class a but in java multiple inheritance won't support we will see why java won't support multiple inheritance and if we come to hierarchical inheritance two different classes extended same class that is class b extends a class c extends a and multi level inheritance here class b extends a class c extends b in class c we have properties of both class b and class a because class c is child for class b and class b is child for class a and this is multi level inheritance now we will see why multiple inheritance won't support in java let us assume class c is a child class that extended two parent classes class a and class b in class a we have method called meth and in class b also we have that same method if we extend these two classes and if we create an object for child class and if we try to access this method java compiler will get confused to which method it has to take uh if we come to interfaces this is in the case of classes if we come to interfaces if we, we can we can do multiple inheritance this is because we are going to do declaration only in interfaces so if we extend so sorry if you implement the two interfaces if the two interfaces has same methods at that time java compiler won't get confused because there will be only uh without implementation there won't be any implementation there uh we will see why java won't support multiple inheritance with example now we are going to declare another class here if we extend another class java compiler will get confused it is getting confused uh to which method it has to take but in case of interface it will work fine uh let it be this is a interface on for in interfaces there will be no implementation here interface implements here we have to implement unimplemented methods that's it interface will support multiple inheritance but classes won't support multiple inheritance 
this is about inheritance in next session we are going to discuss about what is polymorphism and uh, what are the types that are available in polymorphism with examples thank you